Welcome back to another week in my life in New York City. I just got back from Athens, Georgia last night. It was the best weekend ever. If you guys didn't know, I graduated from UGA this past May. So Ryan and I went down and we met up with a ton of our friends for homecoming football weekend. And it was so much fun. If you haven't watched that vlog, pause this one, go watch that, then come back. I have the whole day to myself to get a lot of things done. So we're gonna have a productive day together. Also a little me time too, very important. And then tonight, Brooke and I are gonna record another episode of Gals on the Go podcast. If you don't know, I have a podcast with my best friend, Brooke. Every Wednesday, Gals on the Go, it's a good time. Um, but right now, I'm just filling out my Doing Well Daily Planner, if you guys don't know. I keep saying, if you guys don't know, but I feel like we have some new faces here. Um, I created this daily planner around this time last year with Doing Well Daily, and it literally has a single day on each page. So much, I use it every morning when I wake up. This side's more inspirational. This side is like more of your get your shit done kind of page. If you guys cared, this is what's on my to-do list for today. I need to plan the rest of tonight's podcast. Like I said, we're doing a fall-themed episode. I need to edit last week's week in my life and um, also the Athens vlog, which you guys would already see by now. Brooke and I are also working on our furniture selections for our Gals on the Go office, so we gotta get those ordered because if you guys don't know, I still don't have my couch. <laughs> Love that for me. Furniture back order is real. I want to do a little thing on my Instagram story linking all of my outfits from this past weekend. I had a lot of DMs asking like, Where's your game day outfit from? Where's this going out outfit from? So I wanna do, I like to do these after weekend trips of just like a weekend recap with all the links on my stories. So a reason to follow me on Instagram, at Danielle Carolyn. I wanna order groceries this week. I have no excuse to eat out every day. I wanna make like two to three meals here at home and then have leftovers for lunch the next day. I used to do that all the time in college with Delaney and it was so awesome. I need to pick up a prescription and then I want to unpack. I would like to do something active today, whether it's going for a long walk or hitting the bike downstairs. I don't really know what. It's kind of the layout for the day. I don't have anywhere to be until tonight when Brooke and I record, so I can kind of do all these on my own accord, which is really nice. So right now I'm just enjoying my nice morning, listening to my coffee house playlist. But welcome back. Subscribe if you are new here. Press that little button so we can hang out all the time. All right, let's go. <laughs> So I used to do this all the time in my college vlogs. So I thought I'd tell you guys what I am eating this week. The three meals that I got ingredients for. Ground turkey tacos, so good. You can also turn them into bowls. Rice, beans, green beans, and chicken. And then one pot pasta, which I make with my always pan. It's so good. You literally just put all the ingredients in the pot with a little water and it cooks all together and is chef's kiss. And then I got a ton of other groceries, so I'll do a grocery haul when it comes. I'll cross that off the list. That feels really good. I wanna do the links right now really quick and then I'm gonna make breakfast and then we're gonna get up and unpack, make my bed, all those things. So we're having a productive day, I'm making it happen. Just finished doing the little outfit recap on my Instagram story. Just giving you guys a little look and so you can see. Hey guys, it's like Christmas morning. I just went down to the package room and I got my package from Lily Silk. I am so excited. There's nothing better than feeling nice and luxurious and some nice silk. So I'm so excited today's sponsor is Lily Silk and I'm so pumped to show you guys the things I got. I picked them out, I'm so pumped. So Lily Silk is where you can find all kinds of quality silk products like blouses, pajamas, pillowcases, you name it. So the first thing I got, oh this is 
beautiful packaging. It is a silk pillowcase, of course, because I don't have one here in New York. So mulberry silk has lots of beauty benefits to the skin and the hair, which we love. It absorbs moisture and is very breathable. It's sleep promoting, anti-aging, and it's just super soft. So I'm very excited to put this on my pillow and get the best night's sleep ever. Also something I love about Lily Silk is their zero waste. So if they have any extra silk, they'll use it to make an eye mask or something else, which I think is really admirable. The next thing I got, my nails are getting too long. I need to get them done. It's this beautiful blue blouse. I'm so excited to style this for fall. Oh my gosh, it is so soft and so comfortable. Wow. I got a size medium for reference. I love this color for fall. It adds a little color, but it's still, you know, a little bit more muted with some jeans and like even a blazer. So like I was talking about that mulberry silk earlier, they come from mulberry trees, which require less water than cotton to grow. So they're very environmentally conscious, which is awesome. Next up, I got this night shirt. I'm so excited. I think I'm literally gonna change into that right after I do this unboxing, cause I love like running around my apartment cleaning and stuff in a nice little nightgown. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Have a good day. And the last thing I got, because it's getting colder outside, so we love wearing matching pajama sets. Look how beautiful this teal color is. They have so many color options too. Um, oh, I kind of want to wear this. I don't even know. So it's this beautiful teal um, pajama set. These pants are gorgeous. I love the line down the side. All right, I'm going to change into that night shirt immediately. One sec. Ta-da! <laughs> I mean, look how cute this is. It's so soft, so comfortable. I love this black shiny color. They also have other color options if you want something more colorful, like I have that teal night set. It wouldn't be fair if I didn't give you a coupon code. So if you use DC15, you get 15% off your Lily Silk order. I'll have the links to all the things I got down below. Check out their website, see what you like. But I love this, it's so comfortable, and I'm going to unpack, make my bed, as you can see, and do all those things in this little Fun night shirt. I can't wait to sleep in it tonight too. And my pillowcase, oh my gosh. Thank you so much for calling. I've missed chatting with you. Yeah, we'll see each other soon. We'll see each other soon. Thanksgiving for sure, maybe before, who knows. And I love you, I'm so proud of you. You too. Proud of you. You're doing big things. Oh, thank you. All right, we'll talk soon. Have an amazing day. You too. Love you. Bye. Oh, just caught up with my brother. Okay, gonna do this grocery haul in little segments because I can't fit everything on my table. Um, but we got broccoli, blueberries, blackberries, raspberries somewhere. This is for my yogurt parfait. Broccoli. I just love to cook and eat for lunch with other things. Spinach, this is for the one pot pasta. Grape tomatoes for the one pot pasta. Onions chopped, I know I'm so lazy, for the one pot pasta. <laughs> Salsa for my ground turkey tacos. And rotisserie chicken, I've been craving it. It's so good, okay, judge me. Not a lot of people like it, but I do. I got so many kombuchas, you guys. <laughs> um, three ginger berry, this is my ultimate favorite flavor. Three trilogy. Iceberg lettuce to um, cut up for my tacos. Ground turkey, grape tomatoes for the one pot pasta, raspberries. And then lastly, these are kind of like the dry stuff. Um, I love these granola bars, hate on me. I decided to get some chips and salsa. Sometimes when I have people over, I don't have any snacks really. I don't buy snacks, so I don't snack, but I like chips and salsa. And my aunt just got me this like little chips and dip um, bowl that I want to use. I love paste salsa, it's so good. Taco seasoning for the ground turkey, some more tortillas, garlic for the one pot pasta, kind um, granola, this is my favorite kind of granola, and it's high in fiber, which is amazing, it fills me up more. Little mac and cheeses for late nights. Um, thin spaghetti, this is for the one pot pasta. Yellow rice, black beans, just one of these, I always like to have them on hand. And then, you know, my favorite, Lenny and Larry's Complete Cookies. So I'm going to put all of this away now. It's already one o'clock. I guess I have done a lot, but I wanted to have more done by this hour, but that's okay, that's okay. So it's currently a little bit later and I'm sitting down writing down topics that you guys submitted 
for us to talk about in this week's episode, we decided to hold on the fall themed episode for Gals and the Go to wait till next week. You guys love our girl talk episodes. We like to do those every couple months. So I'm pulling topics right now that you guys submitted. Um, so someone talked, asked for us to talk about our period craving foods. I like that question a lot. Um, how to get over a guy you never really dated, been there. Each of your worst date story. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just pulling some topics right now. I started packing, but then my brain goes in a thousand different directions and if I need to do something in that moment, I just go to my computer and do it while I'm still thinking about it and then I'm gonna go back to unpacking. We're getting a lot done. Today, I was when I was on the phone with my brother, I was like, today's kind of like my Sunday, which is nice. Also, I just pulled my hair back because yeah. Hey. Uh, I just finished unpacking. That feels so good. I could have easily let my suitcase sit there, but I unpacked. I did it. And I can't lie. I love having all my pants hanging up, but it's starting to get a little crowded. Um, and it's really tempting to just fold them. I have my few pairs of shorts folded here. I don't know. I might have to text twice as organized and see what their advice is. Um, but that's good. I just need to put away my packing cubes now. I put them in my coat closet need to figure out what to do with all this fireball merch <laughs> um, i'm gonna take my suitcase down i have some trash things are happening though would like to shower soon and like actually get ready for the day um but yeah that's just the little update getting some vacuuming done i get all these little hairballs from this jute rug if you guys have any tips on how to fix this let me know but from everyone i've talked to that also has a jute rug which is this one they said it just sheds and you just gotta vacuum. Okay, it is now time for lunch for sure. It's almost three o'clock actually. I've got this cute little notepad from Olive in June and I think I'm gonna use it to kind of keep myself in line with my meals and just literally leave it right here. I don't know for now. So I'm gonna write down this week's meals so I visually see them and I know what I have in my fridge. I'm gonna do chicken, I'm gonna boil a pot of water for rice and do broccoli, I'll take it out of the freezer. Oh wait, actually, no, I got fresh broccoli. So I'll use the fresh broccoli first. I love cooking in my always pan, so we're gonna do that. So I will link this little situation down below. I've got the always, or no, the always pan, the perfect pot, but I don't know, it's kind of big to just make the rice in right now. Um, but I'm gonna cook the broccoli in here. I, I literally just cook with olive oil um and it literally tastes so good people are like why don't you use more seasoning but i really like the taste um and then i'm gonna get into that rotisserie chicken and boil a pot of water for rice i make one and a half cups of rice i think smothering the broccoli and olive oil to cook and i usually add just like a little water too so it steams it a little i must add this is just what i do it's not something someone told me to do i don't know if it's right but it works for me I love this pan because it comes with this little thing too that you can just stick on like so, which is nice. All right, wow, I just feel so good. I'm cleaning, I am cooking, I am getting things done. This is incredible. A lovely candlelit lunch by myself. Um, some people may hate on this meal, but I love it. I love chicken, rice, broccoli. Um, I think I'm gonna watch some YouTube while I eat. Now I have leftovers for later. Ooh, it's still nice and steamy. I'm gonna leave the chicken out because it just tastes better when it's not been in the fridge. Um, and my fridge is definitely a lot smaller here. Um, hmm. Yeah, gonna have to figure out where to put this, but that's happening. All right, dishes are done. That's one thing about cooking at home. You have dishes to do, but it's kind of soothing. I've just been listening to Girls Gotta Eat and then pausing it when I start vlogging. Um, just put some stuff in the dishwasher, but I'm not gonna run it yet. I'll wait till the end of the night just as things build up. But it is really quiet, which is really nice. I could totally do it now and it doesn't bother. All right, I think it is finally time to shower and look cute for the day. All right, so it's been a minute. I showered, I put on makeup, I... Did some like Instagram stories and some TikToks, everything of the sorts. And now it's like, it's time for me to get outside. It's almost six o'clock and I haven't been outside yet. Um, I'm happy about it though, I got a lot done. Took a little bit longer than expected, but it's just setting me up for the best week because I didn't have yesterday. So I'm really thankful I had today to kind of do all that. It's a little chilly out. Fall is finally starting to feel like it's in the air. I'm gonna go for a little walk and I was texting with Ryan. He was like, oh, I actually have to go do something near that. So 
we're gonna go for a walk together I also just realized I forgot to order paper towels and coffee creamer this morning So I need to stop by and do that I'm just wearing this black jumpsuit or no, it's sweatsuit from Zara and then I have just a little pop of blue with this bag my platform converse but yeah, I just want to be dressed comfortable because I'm recording the podcast tonight and we don't record it yet in video form. So right now it's just audio, so I don't need to like look any special sort of way. We had the same idea when getting dressed just now. <laughs> Can't go wrong with a little black sweat set situation. It feels so good out, it feels like fall. It's cold. It is cold. Walking in the East Village. Ryan hasn't been to this side. Checking it out. This is Tompkins Square Park. About to walk down 7th Street because the other day when I walked past, there were so many cute restaurants and little coffee shops. This is a cute little neighborhood. I like it. Got the paper towels and Ryan and I went for a nice little walk around the East Village. Put together a little tote bag and head to Brooks. I love our little late night recording sessions. They're so relaxing and fun. Guys, Brooke's apartment is so cozy right now. Right, is this a fall candle that I smell? I have three candles going. This is so cute. Fireside. So I feel oh, like yeah, I think if that's it, what I'm right? selling. She's got the, the Yule log on. I, ah! I something to put on the TV, and I was like, is it too early? No, it's never too early. I love it. Thank you. Late night recording in the studio. <laughs> this is awesome. Hello. Hello, you guys. What is up? Welcome back to Gals on the Go podcast. I'm Danielle. I'm Brooke. Welcome back. Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. We have a fun episode for you guys. Everyone always loves these episodes. We're doing a girl talk episode. Girl talk, talking about some topics that we haven't explored on previous girl talks. So we're like, maybe we like did, did a little bit. Just got back from recording. It's literally 10 o'clock. We talked for so long. Just ate some very late dinner. Watching the Gossip Girl iconic pool episode. I just love this episode so much. It's spicy. Good morning, you guys. We have a day of meetings. Here's my little fit. Jeans, Princess Polly, blazer, nasty gal. It's totally wrinkled. I just, I don't know. Do we care? I don't. Uh, top Nordstrom necklace, the M Jewelers. Headed to the dry bar because I have a membership there, so I'm just going to get a blowout for the week. So we got an event tonight, something tomorrow, two events on Thursday, all very exciting things. So it's a little chilly out, feeling the fall vibes. Got my computer and stuff in here. We're just gonna get after it. Let's go. This might be my favorite blowout to date. She did such a good job. I love when the ends are rounded. So I've been wanting to do this for a while where I take myself to breakfast. I had like a little yogurt and berries this morning, but I'm kind of hungry. So I'm sitting at Maman, it's so cold, it's so relaxing. I'm just gonna sip my latte, eat my breakfast. I'm excited. Broadway shopping. I got invited to a Studio 54 themed party um, on Thursday. So I need like a sparkly dress or something. So we're gonna look really quick. And then we have a Gals on the Go meeting at our office at one o'clock, so I have like an hour. All right guys, big meeting day here with Emma and Brooke. And we are going through all the applications for our Gals on the Go assistant. I'm so excited. Same. It's been a long time coming. It's been a long time coming. Yeah. There are so many now and we want to truly like read them all in depth and make sure we're giving everyone the equal opportunity. So big day, big conference girls. <laughs> I know, it's I'm nice. excited. Guys, I just figured out how to get this on the TV. We're going <laughs> through with Emma, our studio ideas. We did it. Yeah. Oh, We're done. <laughs> we just sent out our second round of inner or first round of interviews. So I'm so excited. 
We are now headed to Chipotle. We all have the same idea. We were all hungry for dinner, an early dinner, kind of a late lunch. I don't even know what to call it. And then we're gonna go home. I have a couple like computer stuff to do, get dressed, and then we're going to this event at the veranda tonight. Um, so that's, that's the tea. All right, I just got back and I thought I'd show you guys a little Zara haul of the things I got today. I actually waited in the line today because I had some time before our meeting. First thing I got is this bright green um, just button down. It's great for layering for fall. I love it. It also is perfect for a jacket during this time of year because it's kind of that in between. So I really like it. It'd be cute with just like a black crop top and black biker shorts too. Next up is this puffer vest. I'm so excited. Puffers are back, baby. And I love this color. I was looking for a brown puffer to layer and it does have pockets, I believe. Yes, which is nice. This is literally perfect with this outfit, honestly. Um, Zara had really cute stuff. I wanted to buy like all the puffer vests in there, but I held myself back. Okay, bury me in this dress. Holy crap, I'm so happy I bought this. I didn't try it on, I can't lie. Um, this is so cute. I'm loving midi dresses, midi skirts right now. So perfect. Zara, go snatch this up. I'm obsessed. I mean, this is so perfect. I could like wear a jacket over it, a blazer, or I mean, there's so many options with this. So cute. The material is amazing. It's very thick. It's ribbed. Oh my gosh. This is so, so cute. Okay. And then for the Studio 54 thing, this is the only like glitzy thing I could find at Zara. I kind of love it. I really like it where I could like belt it. I think it has some potential. All right, guys, I just responded to some emails, recorded some stuff for the podcast. And now we are about to head to this event at the veranda in Soho. It's a restaurant and they're doing an event called Midweek Martinis, which I think is so fun from like six to eight. So Brooke and I are going, our friend Allie's meeting us there, Kit's meeting us there. It'll be a good time. It's like a, Brooke was like, I have to be back for The Bachelor because tonight's the premiere. Um, so yeah, I'll show you guys my outfit. I'm wearing my new Zara dress. So I've got the dress on and then I wanted some sort of blazer, but I mean, the booty looks good. So I'm wearing this cropped blazer from Princess Polly. I really, really like it. And then my Steve Madden Cobra boots. I will link them down below. You guys need them. They are seriously so comfy. And if you're short and you want to be taller, these give a ton of height. So I really like this outfit. Simple, but I think really chic at the same time gonna use this bag I think it'll be fun I'm excited yeah, this is so beautiful I'm here with Ali I love it. there's Brooke this is so cute I still teach yoga online but I also take just teach like just finished editing another week in my life that's going up tomorrow it's almost midnight it's close to midnight hey I still have my makeup on. The event was so much fun. I am gonna take a quick body shower, clean up my bed, get in bed, read, and then go to bed. Good morning, guys. I got some good sleep last night, despite my awful mood right now. Not awful. I was in a great mood. I have the Yule Log on. I've got jazz music playing. It's paused right now. However, I am in a bad mood because my table and chairs are from Crate and Barrel. They deliver just fine. CB2, um, owned by Crate and Barrel. I got my bed from them and my other chair from them and all everything else, my plants from them. And my couch just isn't here. And the couch is kind of the most important thing next to the bed and the table. Um, and so I texted Sierra, my interior designer, and she said she's never had this experience with Crate and Barrel ever. And all of you guys have been DMing me saying like, you're having the same issues. Some people have been waiting since April and that's terrifying to me. Um, completely understand with COVID, there's so many shipping delays, there's supply chain issues, totally understand. But now it's like, like they just, she just called again and they pushed it back from October 22nd to October 31st. And it's just, I don't want my lease to be about to be up and I just get my couch, you know? Like, I don't know, maybe I'll stay here next year, but just so frustrating and this couch style I want, there's only so many couches like it and they're pretty much all on back order. So unsure what to do. 
No, I say we do it. It's so beautiful. It's so sick. It was the other style we looked at and it's in stock and I'm tired of my air mattress. So. It's made a delivery between October 20th, which is today. 20th, yeah. October 20th and Tuesday, October 26th. Woo! So you'll get an email about scheduling delivery and then we go from there? Yeah, it's like a two week delivery window. Yeah. 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 So you'll get an email about scheduling delivery and then we go from there? Yes. And also, you know what I was thinking? All right, new couch is on the way. I am so excited. It's so, it's honestly cooler looking than the other one. The other one was just a little bit cozier, but I guess if I really want to get cozy, I'll get in bed. You guys know me, I'm very on the go. I don't like sit on the couch all the time, so it'll be fine, but like also I do want a couch. So I'm excited. It probably will be here literally next week, which is so exciting. Anyways, now that we have a couch, we need to shower and get started with the day. Feeling an iced coffee today. Ta -da. All right, here is today's little fit. I'm wearing my Year of Ours romper. I love it, I'll link below. Jacket, I will also link below. Sneakers, you guys know. Bag, you guys know. We're gonna go get our nails done. I'm headed to Miki now, Miki Nail Co. These are so grown out. I think I'm gonna do like a light pink ombre situation. I'm really excited. My nails are so long. I have gel extensions on right now, but I think we're gonna take them off. So yeah, big day of appointments. I will wax later too. So glamorous. Just think about. So I did this super neutral baby pink color. Took off the gel extensions. These are my natural nails now. She basically just did a very light pink gel with a little white over top. I didn't want to do a super dramatic ombre. I just love this. It's so pretty, feminine, yay. All right, quick change because all of a sudden it's summer outside again. So here is my little fit to run errands. Top is from Princess Polly. I love it. It's from Motel Rocks. Jeans are from Meshki, I think. They're like Bermuda vibes. Little tote bag and sneakers because we're going to European Wax Center getting a wax. And then I'm gonna walk over to the Zara in Soho and exchange this dress that I got from Zara because it was broken. Just got back from my errands. I got so much done. This is the dress. I returned it and got a new one. I am so excited. I might wear this tonight, might not. Also stopped by Spirit Halloween. I donated, so I got this um, little bracelet. So sweet. I got, I FaceTimed Brooke and we picked out costumes to match together for one night because events keep popping up and then you need a costume. So we just put together a costume. I picked up a prescription. Makeup clips are back and I just love it. Um, going to dinner tonight, so I'm gonna start getting ready here in a little bit. Got some computer stuff to do, gonna tidy up around here. All right, just got ready for dinner. Brig and I are going to dinner with Bridget. She's also known as Acquired Style. Her sister, actually her twin sister, Danielle, might be joining too, but she has a work dinner. I love those girls. I seriously, we are always running into each other at events and it's one of those things like, let's like actually get dinner and chat. Um, so just another dinner, I'm telling you guys. So many dinners in New York. I really like my outfit tonight. The weather's so nice. We're going to Gemma. I've been wanting to eat there. It's in the Bowery Hotel. Um, I'm really excited. I don't think Brooke's been there. I don't know if the girls have been there yet, but I'm really looking forward to it. And then I'm gonna come back and um, Ryan like asked me if I wanted to watch the game with him and I said I had dinner, but maybe I'll hang out with him after. We haven't really seen each other, but that's kind of like how the weekdays go, so. I'm gonna show you guys my fit. All right, here's the fit for tonight. Big Hailey Bieber vibes. I'm just wearing the denim shorts as much as I can before it actually gets cold. Um, this black tank top is from Parallel Apparel. Shout out Ashley and Alicia, I love their clothes. Jean shorts are from EB Denim. This blazer I wore yesterday, it is from Mastiel. And then my boots are from Steve Madden. I'll link them below. They're so comfy. I was gonna wear my heeled boots like this, but we're walking, so. Big no. I literally haven't even like used heat on my hair since I went to the dry bar yesterday. So love that. I probably could fix it up. I definitely could, but I just don't want to. So that's where I'm at with that. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna head to dinner. I'm so excited. Hopefully Brooke and I are gonna grab some pics of each other on our walkover, because that's just what we do. Um, and yeah, I'm in a good mood. I've been listening to Drake all night, so I can't complain.
Ryan's got his Braves hat on. Let's go, Braves. He's re- he's like, we have to get there. It's commercial break right now. Like, <laughs> so we're trying to find a spot. It's cool in there too. Mama's bar. No, oh, he wants to go to the Harry Lemon. everybody today is a day full of events i'm so excited i'm so blessed to be able to go to all these events now that i live in new york city it's so fun it's so crazy how much goes on here um so we're starting the day off at maman it's actually the cafe i went to the other day but a different location um we are going to brunch with stony clover they have really cute tote bags cosmetic bags and they're doing a collaboration with american girl doll so I'm like, this is so full circle, this is so crazy. I'm sure a lot of the other girls going feel like this too because I used to be obsessed with American Girl dolls. Fun fact, I've never been to the American Girl doll store because when I was like that age, I had never been to a city that had one. So I'll go one day. If it's taking my daughter or my niece or something, I'm going. Um, if you guys have any little sisters that wanna go, I will take them. Anyway, so that's the first event, and then I have a little bit of time. Brooke and I are gonna walk back and maybe pop into some shops, because why not? Um, but I do need to come back, get some stuff done, because then at five, our friend Shelby Church, who lived in LA, she just moved out, and she's like doing a month in different cities. So this month, she's in New York City. She creates the best YouTube content, and she is doing this video where she checks out all the popular rooftops in New York City and rates them with other YouTubers. So Brooke and I are doing that with her today at the Nolitan rooftop, I guess it's called. Right after that, Brooke and I, <laughs> Brooke and I just do everything today. <laughs> Brooke and I have dinner with Morgan Yates, who is in town from LA. I haven't seen her in like two years. If you guys don't know, Morgan and I are super close. We literally traveled to Spain together and all this stuff. I am so excited to see her. Dress, I wore it in Rhode Island, if you watched the Rhode Island vlog. I love this dress, it's perfect for brunch. It's from Realization Par, and it's like a little chilly out, so I thought this was perfect. But I had to add my own little spice to it with these white cowgirl boots. You guys know I love them. Earrings from Lisa Goslin. I need to figure out how to pronounce it, but these hoops are so cute, and the way they clasp is just so convenient. The necklace is from the M Jewelers. So yeah, this is the fit for brunch. I'm so excited. Here are some girlies with Hannah, Brooke, and Carly. This is the cutest event, you guys. I'm dead. We're at the bow bar right now, about to get some custom American Girl doll bows. Bow. I thought it said brow bar, and I was like, no, why would oh. it say brow bar? And now we get this our is brows so done. Cute. Drinking our caffeinated drinks. Yes, we the, the little napkins. Yes. <laughs> I'm so honored. Ryan's got his Braves hat on. Let's go, Braves. He's re- he's like, we have to get there. It's commercial break right now. Like, <laughs> so we're trying to find a spot. It's cool in there too. Mama's bar. No. He wants to go to the Harry Lemon. All right, you guys. The event was amazing. Literally left with an American Girl doll. I got Molly. I Brooke got Samantha. Got Samantha. <laughs> <laughs> so it was literally so much fun. So many of our friends were there. It was such a so beautiful, fun. like, well done event. Mm-hmm. Great start to the day. On, I love them. Like, not morning, but like that was like well, nine thirty. It was morning, morning, but like not seven a.m. Yo, but, you for know, sure. Yeah, no. It was so much fun, got yeah. to meet so many fun people, and now we're just walking around Soho, gonna stop in some stores, and then get on with the rest of our day. We're literally walking around with our little American I, Girl yeah. doll bags, our big American Girl big. doll bags, actually. Um, just got back from the event, and I posted on my story, and everyone was asking which doll I got, and I got Molly, because I had her when I was younger, and it's so beautiful, this is so crazy. Ryan's here in the daytime. So exciting. He was like, I have a chill day today. And I was like, oh, making lunch. Come hang. And then I bought this skirt at Aritzia because we were walking by. Um, It's like a little midi skirt. And then I also got a customized Stony Clover bag, which I'm so excited. Their collaboration with American Girl Doll comes out tomorrow. And my case to five phone case just came in. I got a customized one for my new phone. So I'm excited to check this out. We're going to make some ground turkey tacos. Um, Brooke was like, do you want to get lunch? I was like, no, I have groceries. I must make them. And she was like, you know, I do too. So I'm proud of us. <laughs> so we're going to do some ground turkey. I have, what else did I get for this? Oh, iceberg lettuce. Taco seasoning is very important to the success of your meat, I find. Especially if you get ground turkey because it's a little healthier. 
I need the taco seasoning at least. Tortillas, Ryan, I'm sorry, I don't have avocados. But oh, and I got pico de gallo. Ryan, you like that? All right, big reveal, opening my little case to five case. I like my brown one I have on it right now. It's getting so dirty already, <laughs> like that's gross. But I got this one customized. Ah, it looks so good. It's like a little checkered DC. So yeah, I'm gonna put that on my phone. Just, I like trust case to five phone case with my life. It's like, like this is sturdy. I dropped this, it's okay. It's gonna be okay. Yeah, very pumped about this. So cute too. I just like, I just got black and white, so. Lunch is served, got a little taco bar. Ground turkey tacos are seriously so delicious and so filling, I'm so excited. Voila, so easy, literally cooked it in like 10 minutes. Hello everybody, so Ryan just left, we hung out for a little bit and I have a couple hours for myself before the rest of the evening. I'm flipping the page on my doing well daily. Today's quote, I think you should just go for it. So I always do this thing where like if I didn't get it done the day before, I just transfer it over. I mean, makes sense, right? So we need to fill out my COI form. So if you guys didn't know what that is, some apartment buildings are required. If you're getting furniture delivered, you need to fill out this like insurance thing with the store. So for our office, we just finished ordering all the furniture for that. So we need to fill that out. I need to get some content for this TikTok I want to make. I've been inspired by TikTok lately. The event I went to this morning was literally all TikTok people. We need to get the paint color for our office. We picked out a perfect color. All right. So I'm gonna get to all of this. Okay, so like I was telling you guys earlier, we're headed to the No Lead In with Shelby to do her video about, ooh, that's kind of cool off the shoulder. Should I keep it? Um, I'm so late, I really need to start walking, but we're meeting Shelby to do this rooftop thing where she's rating a ton of rooftops, so I'm honored that she has Brooke and I. So we're gonna go get some drinks before dinner, gal on the goat type of day. Um, but here's my little fit. I literally just threw it together and I'm really happy with it. A couple new pieces. This top from Zara, I just got, I thought it'd be perfect for layering, but I'm actually just wearing it on its own. Leather shorts just got in the mail from Nasty Gal. I've been looking for the perfect pair of leather shorts. I think these are it. I like how they're a little bit longer too. We'll link them down below. And I've been looking for the perfect pair of white booties. These are also from Nasty Gal. They are just the most comfortable. So I will also link them down below. Hopefully they're not sold out yet. Same white bag. I'm so excited. So yeah, we're going to the No Lead In and then straight from there to the Rin Tin Tin. All right, back with my gal. It's only been a few short hours <laughs> since we've been last together. <laughs> um, I love how we both wore button downs. I know, I, feel like I thought you were wearing a blazer, blazer so I was like, okay, I, I won't wear my blazer. Work, so. Well, and also like, I don't care. I don't know, I don't care either. These are two pretty different. If you were wearing tall boots, then it would be similar, but you're not. All right, these, are, these are my favorite shoes. Vince Camuto from- So cute. The, the so cute, love, love a tall them. boot. Walking down Elizabeth Street right now, it's so pretty. Yeah, All right, streets. let's go get drunk, no kidding. <laughs> We're same side friends. I, Danielle wanted to do this. I want to talk to both of them. I get it. I see you all I the time, it. you know? I feel like we want to talk to them. So we're at this really cute place called Rin Tin Tin. This is so cute. Look at our stickers. Show you, where's your sticker? I'm vaccinated. I know, so cute. That's adorable. Love an espresso martini moment. We're trying to get cute pics. We're being those girls right now. <laughs> yeah. I've gotten really bad water. Actually, watch. Here with the gals, say hello. They're vaccinated, if you guys were wondering. They're like, because they pop on your black shirts. I know, this is awesome. Hello, hello, we just, yes, it's it's all the rage. Got our food, delicious. What is that? Just got another drink, I don't know, I it's pasta. Mushroom, I don't know, let's get after it. Morning everybody. Leaving the shades down, so I have a bit of a chiller morning. Um, it's really sunny out, and I feel like being cozy. I'm so hungry. <laughs> I didn't update you guys last night. I literally didn't end up going to the Studio 54 thing. Our dinner with Morgan and Giselle was so much fun. We stayed and talked for so long, like longer than expected, but like, I haven't seen her in over two years, and I really just wanted to chat. And then by the time dinner was over, I was kind of tired and 
my stomach didn't feel well. I didn't, like, I had three drinks, but every drink was, like, a different alcohol, which is amateur move right there. I don't know what I was thinking. And I came back, and my friend was there at the event, and she was like, they're over capacity right now. Um, there's a line. And by the time I got there, I would have been super late and whatever. She eventually got in, but I, I don't know. I, I couldn't do it. So... Now I have the sequin dress. Today is a good day. Today is not a day full of events. Yesterday was so much fun and I am so thankful I get to share it all with you guys. Anyways, the only thing I have today is a call at 2.30. So there's things I need to get done, but I like have so many dishes to do. I wanna clean, might change my sheets, but I also might wait till the end of the weekend. I'm not sure. But yeah, it's gonna be like a slow morning. I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna take you guys along. I have to edit my Athens vlog so it goes up on Sunday. Um, but I think it's, it's gonna be a good day. And then Ryan and I, I don't think we want to like go out tonight. Um, we really want to, cause tomorrow there's no football game tomorrow for UGA. So, which sounds crazy, but like when there's a bye week, it's, I don't know. It's like ah, we can take a break. We don't have to like drink and watch this game at 12 o'clock or whatever it is. There's no game tomorrow. So we want to do something fun during the daytime. So I've been watching TikToks all morning in bed trying to find like cool NYC date spots. So I'll definitely share with you guys where we go. Get in me belly. Apartment is finally clean. The cluttered dishwasher is going. Table is clean. Floors are vacuumed. Trash is gone. My bed is made. Like things are good. I can finally do other things with my day. It's time to take a shower. I need to leave my apartment um, or do something. I have a call at 2:30. I think it's like 12:30 now. Um, I'm gonna make some lunch too. I think I'm gonna make some broccoli. I don't really know what else I'm gonna make. I have a video to edit, I have some emails to respond to. Um, but I can't do anything without showering. I shower, I've always said this, but like twice a day here in the city. I don't know why. But anyways, see you guys after. Hello, Finley, I miss you. I miss you, Finley. Hi. Hi, Finley, baby. Oh my gosh, he's wagging his tail. Yeah. Hi, Finley Monster. Oh, I miss him so much. I'm booking my Thanksgiving. Any questions or anything like that that I can answer for you on this call? Um, I have a quick question about. I had a call, and I didn't know if it was gonna be video or not. So, I, but to be safe, I um put on a blazer, and my glasses always make me look more official. My manager texts me. She's like, "Love your work from home fit or your Zoom fit." Um, so that was a merch call. We're finalizing everything so we can release the merch very, very, very soon. So yeah, I'm just doing some follow-up emails for that. We're working on a holiday drop now too. We're gonna schedule a meeting with our graphic designer, Emma, to figure that out. But yeah, good things are happening. Oh, and my dad FaceTimed me. He's literally a gem and walked me through how to get my AC working again. And now it's back to 71. It literally got up to 81, you guys. I was dying, so. Bless up. Had some calls. Makeup clips are back in to keep my hair up. It's not dinner time yet, but I have some more broccoli, like half a bag left. I freaking love broccoli. It's the tastiest thing, especially if you. I like softer broccoli. I don't like it to be super crunchy. Um, so I'm just gonna cook the rest of this bag, eat it, and then. Um, have a whole fun weekend ahead um, and I'm gonna make dinner tonight and do the one pot pasta because that's the last set of ingredients because that's the last set of ingredients that 
I have in my fridge. So I successfully made all the meals. Love that for me. It's actually a lot of broccoli, but we love it. It's good. Broccoli is good for you and it's yummy. That ends this week in my life vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. We have some exciting weeks up ahead. Next week is Halloween, so that's gonna be a really fun vlog. And then the week after that, Brooke and I are going to LA for some podcast stuff and just for fun, so that'll be fun. Lots to catch up on here, so make sure to go follow me on TikTok. I've been posting one to two TikToks a day. I don't know what's up with me, but I'm obsessed right now. That's at Danielle underscore Carolyn. Follow me on Instagram, at Danielle Carolyn. And subscribe here so you get notified every time I post a video, which is every Wednesday and Sunday. So subscribe down below. I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for coming along. About to start the weekend. About to start the weekend vlog. Many vlogs to come. Love you guys so much. Thanks so much for sticking around. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.